Hey guys, Zuljan here and welcome back to another episode of Pixar. I hope y'all are doing great today. I know Squishy, it's uh it's kind of a uh, it's kind of a mess here. We're taming a sauropod, guys. So <laughs> I'm using truffles to tame this sauropod. Drax says, get on the back of one and just let it walk. And I did, and it works out great. Um, I wanted a female because Drax is his male, and we want to use them to try to take on that big reaper. Um, but because I saw I saw some Spanish guy do um, or a Spanish YouTube channel do it with three of three sauropods. So I think it might be fun to try. I don't know, and I hadn't tamed one anyway, so I figured that we'd do it. But um, yeah, I don't know either, Squishy. <laughs> it seems kind of crazy. The biggest thing about this, now that we got this, name contains a banned word, huh? Now that we got this, it walked down a hole. And I don't know how to get it out. Uh, I did bring a saddle. Let's see here. I had uh, a normal sauropod saddle at home. I have an apprentice at home too, but the um, the normal sauropod saddle is actually uh, it actually has a better armor rating. The apprentice one had just had a high durability or whatever. So let's see what we can do. Oh my God, you are slow, ain't you? Okay, we're gonna have to kill some of these gym spiders, so we may as well. Oh yeah, look at the range. So I think one of the reasons why the uh, the guys that were doing that uh, that Reaper kill or that Reaper King kill was because uh, with the sauropods is because of the range that this guy has. Like they were far away hitting it, so that's probably what it's gonna be like. And I could probably hit this guy too. And he hits hard, man. Two hundred and seventeen is nothing to mess around with. This is why he destroys. Um, bases and stuff. Oh yeah, the range on this thing is just ridiculous, man. I could go a little bit further in, I think. Just to kill this last gem spider. One more time, baby. Other way. Uh, maybe not. A little bit more. A little bit more. Ah, uh, gem spider is dead. Okay, and now it's windy. Well, we can go exploring. We can go caving with a Bronto. That sounds fun, doesn't it? Uh, so what kind of stamp? So the guy has pretty good stamina. I'm hoping that there's actually a way out in here that's easy. Uh, that's another thing I'd like to kill is an actual armadillo. They can drop some pretty good stuff from what I hear. They also act as smelters, but I have a bug smelter at the house. Actually, the one that I did in yesterday's video, I have two bugged smelters now so the the one that I painted white the fireplace it never goes out <laughs> so somebody said that the reason that that might happen oh he's balled up he's not gonna take any damage um, somebody said the reason that that might happen is the fact that there's um, when the server resets and the fire is going then it has the chance to like bug out or something like that. So that might be a thing. But at any rate, this one has wood in it, not um, not what you call not the uh, not the fire powder. So it's making charcoal, which is which is great. There is is that a werewolf up there? No, that looks like another gem spider. Oh, I'm just stepping on this guy. I'm just stepping on him. There we go. Let's put let's put some melee damage here. We got 8295 health. That's crazy. And now 138 damage. Very cool. So yeah, that's just a spider up there. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get out of here, but didn't I see a cyclops up here? I did. I did see a cyclops. So, I should just be able to smack the heck out of this dude. Dude, Bronto's are crazy. Like, don't get me wrong. Rex has hit a lot harder than this. But this range with two of us, this might be a thing, man. This might be a thing. Their, their range is just nuts. All right, Cyclops. You going to try to do something now? It's kind of late, buddy. You can't do nothing. Not nothing. I'm going to continue hitting you. I should put a dot on you, too. I should put a little dot on you with uh, with some of my magic powers. Or are you can I uh, can I still hit you? Yes. I hit you on back back tail swipe smack. That's <laughs> that's the Bronto smack. 
otherwise known as the dinosaur pimp slap. All right. <laughs> I still don't know how I'm going to get out of this freaking cave, man. So there's a way that way, but that looks like world border. So I'm probably going to have to go... I mean, I could probably go a little bit forward here. I don't know how many times I'm going to have to hit this dude. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Did you drop something? You did. You did drop something. Let's go see what it is. A metal arrow. Or two metal arrows, actually. Oh, wait. No, Sorpa. Stay. I don't know what we naming you. Big Galoot is what I should. And you know what? I am. Oh, look. Look who's back for some more. Look who's back for some more. There we go. Did you drop anything for me? No chest, huh? No. No chest. Okay, let's see what we could do here. Oh my goodness. I think this is actually going deeper, man. I think this is going deeper. It's hard to tell with the wind. This is terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm going to have to turn around and try. I'm going to have to build a stairway up or something, guys. Sheesh. What a predicament. What a predicament. Now I'm stepping all over an armadillo. Excuse me. Coming through. <laughs> I have a buddy of mine that used to... I don't know what why where he got this or whatever but he would go he would go maybe he would call big people big hemas like you big hema or big kahima i forgot how he called i might call this one big kahima big kahima sounds it's it's just a little word i i don't i don't know if it's a cajun word that he came up with or just something in his that he used just as like a nickname for somebody or whatever his brother was quite big at the time so he might have he might have just just made up a word one day, but it had a nice ring to it or whatever. So I might name this one Big Kahima. I don't know, guys. I'm going to end up taking this one back to the entrance and see if I can actually get him out of here. Yo, look at this. He just walked out of there. He just walked out. This guy's hitbox is so massive. Oh, my goodness. I wonder if I could do it again. I was like, I, I didn't know where to build. For look at this. How ridiculous! Well, this might be too much. How ridiculous is that, though? All right, can can we can I turn around or something? Uh oh. Uh oh yeah. Come on, baby, turn hard left, Kahima. Hard left. Rich. All right. Let's go forward now. Uh, are you stuck? I I think you're stuck. Uh. Is there is there really a bat trying to do something right now? Can't you see I'm busy here? We stuck in the terrain. Moved, uh, little, uh, Parasaur. Parasaur. Look at this. I'm stuck. My booty is in, is stuck. Oh, man. I am going to have to get out of here. How, how do I even do this? Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa! <laughs> well, that worked. So if if ever you get stuck on a Bronto in a cave like this, all you really have to do is uh just just get off its back for a little minute and just try to climb up every dead gum wall. And I don't know either, Squish. I don't know how it works, man. But it's working. Look at this. Look at this. Oh yeah. All right. So how do we level this thing in the wind and, and all that? I think we need to go to the doom biome, the doom plains. It's right over there. I think we're going to try to mess around in the doom plane. This is just crazy, man. He's so big. God dang, he's big. It makes my character model look bigger now that I'm on top of this a little bit, you know? All right. How deep is this water? Can we swim? Yeah, I could swim. Well, keep Squishy's head above water. Keep it above the water. Look at it, my little doggy paddle that I got going on. 
Can I attack in the water too? Sure can. <laughs> wow. Just brutalized him. Okay, stay away from the lava. Away from the lava. We need to go up the ramp and just aim for some stuff. Oh, we need stamina too. Look at the little dodo train passing. Okay, there's a, a golem. All right. I wonder if I can actually use AOE to my advantage here. You know, the bad thing about this is if, uh, if I can't kill it, it's going to kill me. Is it stuck or something? Oh, there we go. I don't know if I'm I'm not really knocking it back. It's knocking me back, but I'm doing some damage to it. It's bleeding, and I'm not. Can you imagine a mate boosted pair like this? So Drax has got a female. I don't know how much he's leveled it. I'm pretty sure he has not used it for battle much. You, who would think? To use one of these for battle. Battle Bronto, you know? But man, Kahima is set out for glorious things. Also, look at the seeds and stuff I'm getting. This golem must be stuck. And we're just gonna smack on it until it gives us some levels. How much experience does do these things give anyway? We have roughly let's see how much XP I have. Um 596. Okay. I don't know how long it's going to take. I had brought my sniper rifle to kind of uh, sit. Oh, look at this. Oh, I thought I thought one of those things were going to come to me. It was running like it was. So 596 goes up to 886. That's 300. Not bad, not bad, not bad. All right. Stay away from the lava. It didn't drop anything except for its little meat pie or whatever. We need to get a little a group of some things that we could just smack around. We're close to the world border, so I imagine this might be a pretty good spot to try stuff with. These things set you on fire and stuff, too. I wonder if I can hit them through the world border. Let's try. Right on the edge and flap. Yep. Sure can. A little bit further back and I would be hitting both of them. Beep. 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 Oh. I think I'm just going to turn around. That'll be easier. Turn it around. Put your head through, babe. Oh. Ah, all right. I'm going to kill something right here. All right. This is probably far enough. <laughs> 272 now. There goes one. So the knockback doesn't exactly keep him at bay because it's a little slow. I wonder if two of them would, though. Also, we could bring an extra Bronto. You know, like we could do like three or four, maybe. Just let them take the bulk of the damage. Because, man, these things are like, they have 8k hit points. Look at this. Look at this. Like, I've been fighting big things and it's it's... My goodness, these things are quite powerful. Quite powerful indeed, man. Uh, all right. Time for the real test here. I guess minotaurs. Let's try some minotaurs. Are you going to attack me? Or should I initiate? Fine. You can't go through the world border. That's not how this works. Oh, you think I'm going to stop because of a little hole? Boy, I done scaled so many cliffs so far. He 
You can't escape Big Kahima. Slow, steady persistence. Like thumping, stomping doom headed for you. And these things don't even attack back. Bruh. To heck with a Rex in this place. You can just use a Bronto. And honestly... Oh, you doing some damage to me? How cute. How cute. Yeah, Squishy, he don't know nothing. He, <laughs> he don't know nothing. Oh my goodness. Look at it. I'm sure y'all hear the furious clicking. Click, click, clicking. Let me slow down because I don't need a spam click. Goodness knows. All I need to do is just kind of smack this thing around. You can't go through the but you can't run. Well, you can. <laughs> Technically, I really couldn't catch you <laughs> if you tried. Just trying to give you a hint, little, little Minotaur. 242. Oh, yeah. I have a feeling that this thing leveled up would be, like, ridiculous, man. I might just level this one up on live stream, too. Oh, you coming back for some more? You coming back, huh? Boom! I gained the level 2, which I greatly needed because I am so short on Ingram points. Let's go down here and see what we got. We got a chainsaw. Not that I ever use those, but it's a thing. And this is just nothing. Garbage. Garbage. Well, I am extremely happy about this. Uh, I think I'm going to drop this one off at Drax's base, to tell you the truth. Uh, because we're probably going to be heading out from there to fight the Reaper. Drax's base is way south, so it's going to be a heck of a walk, guys. You want to see something pretty cool? I passed by one of these earlier. So right inside there, you see how they have the ruins? Well, they usually have the ruined skeletons and stuff. I can't really see if there's any right now, but... Smack! I don't know what I'm hitting in there. It might just be those vases or whatever. <laughs> it probably is, to tell you the truth. Hold on. There's a skeleton over there. Or is that what I was hitting? Hold on, I have to be able to hit these guys. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Y'all don't stand the chance. Skeleton ruins. Hey, is not now is no time to poop, Big Kahima. All right. Oh, we got one left. Seriously, we we got we got this covered. We got it covered. Excuse us. I'll take the, uh... Oh, hey! What's going on here? Oh! Oh! I see! Wait! Wait up! <laughs> Big Kima, come back! I have no idea what you're doing! Uh-oh. There's a skeleton in here. Um... Big Kima! I don't even know how to get up here. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Hold on. We got this. I think. Hopefully he killed everything. The battle music is gone. So he either got out of range. Or he's just finished with him. I see him. I see him. Come back here, crazy. You done killed everything without me? Well, that's all I got to do is put you on aggressive, huh? Good lord. Okay, <laughs> I guess he got a, a bunch of people mad. I got a chomper seed. I don't think I ever seen one of these things. All right, how much damage? Oh, my goodness. Well, he still got a little ways to go before I get to Drax's. Yeah. And by the way, guys. Oh, no, we're in a cave again. God dang it. And there's a Sarko down here. Oh, well. Yeah, I lost my map files. When I uh, when I reset, I did a, um, I did a reformat. A little while back and yeah I lost my map files <laughs> so I didn't even think about backing them up from the server but I know that happened in Ark all the time too goodness all right big 
I would say big for nothing, but you actually are big for something. I just don't know if I could get you out of here. I'm not going to put you guys through this. I'll figure it out. And we have finally made it. It was a long trip with two holes and plenty of kills, but I think I did pretty good as far as uh, the, the, this area is just loading in. Two tracks' base is getting massive. This guy is doing some serious work. He's got bridges going all over the place. Good lord. Oh, Sam. You only level 26? Man, you look tiny compared to Big Gehima. Yeah, we definitely gonna need to get a female so we can have a um, mate boosted. He needs to get a higher level one anyway. Um, but yeah, expect to see that in the next couple episodes, I'm hoping, you guys. I think that is gonna be it for Squishy and I today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give us some dap on that like button to show your support, and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljan signing off, and we'll see you next time.